taking this Giordani Oriflame Giordani foundation and this is a very 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 lighter uh, shade now Ashwarya have a very milky white skin color and I don't have one I have a dusky one so I'm going to convert my skin color from dusky to pale and I'm going to look like a vampire have sucked blood out of me next I'm going to take my Rimmel London concealer and I'm going to apply that on my uh, under eye area and blend it gently once the concealing is done I'm going to take my Oriflame matte pressed powder and I'm going to set the concealer and the powder with the face powder to take a golden uh, eye pencil this is a local brand you can take any base golden base and apply next I'm going to take this loose pigment from faces Canada and I'm going to apply that on my moving lid area with a flat shade of brush and this brush is from Krylon now this is a very uh, bright golden color and she have a little bit soft golden so I'm going to take that uh, dark golden shade from UV palette and I'm going to apply that on the top of the Faces Canada golden eyeshadow which I applied before once that is done we are going to apply some matte black eyeshadow on our outer V now Ashwarya have some uh, blackish touch in our outer V but she do not have any smoky eye look so we are just going to put a little bit of black and dab the excess and we are going to blend it just a very light touch of black eyeshadow at the outer V next we are going to mix that um, both the golden eyeshadows and we are going to apply that on our brown area and on our lower lash line as well we line our eyes now now i'm taking this uh, lacme eyeliner she uh, ashwarya she do not have any cat eyeliner or any winged eyeliner in this look she have a very thin eyeliner which stops right there next we are going to apply mascara on our lashes i'm going to take colossal maybelline colossal mascara i don't think she have any false lashes in this look so i'm also going to avoid that uh, for the second coating of mascara i'm going to take my mua mascara and i'm going to apply that on my upper lashes and my lower lashes and i broke my favorite contouring powder that is too sad next i'm going to uh, contour my cheeks with this faces canada faces canada brush yes and we are going to blend it with a stippling brush this is from vega she have a very heavy contouring in this look her, her cheeks were full of blush so I'm going to take this uh, blush this is from tips and toes I'm going to apply that on my uh, apple of my cheeks next uh, line your lips this is a Jordana lip liner and I'm going to fill in my lip with the same lip liner and apply the lipstick this is Lacme 664 and our lip and I feel I applied some excess so I'm going to kiss my hand like that and take the excess out and I'm going to apply some golden same golden pigment from Faces Canada I'm going to apply on the uh, center of my lips once going to take we're going to take this brush we're not going to brush our teeth we're going to brush our hairs and this will make your hair look more tidy and sleek see it brushes so well just like that and set our head and we are done 
this was the complete look which was inspired by Ashwarya Rai Khan's Festival 2013 makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this tutorial and I will see you again in my next tutorial guys. Till then stay healthy, stay beautiful, stay gorgeous. God bless you guys. Bye bye. Love you all. Bye bye guys.